Hey y'all, hey, it's Veronica here with the Coffee Drinking Shopping Mama. Welcome back to my channel. I know I've been gone a hot minute, but with New Year's and Christmas and the kids being out of school and my husband having days off from work and we went to visit family in Louisiana, it's just been um, one thing after the other and hard to pick up a camera. You know how it is when you're the mom and it gets, it gets tough to do the things you normally do that you like to do, whatever, anyway. So this is a grocery haul. I went to Costco yesterday, but I'm gonna show you what I got. Today we went to Aldi and to Tom Thumb. Aldi, I spent $119, Tom Thumb like $19. I went in specifically for raspberries at Aldi, $119 later, and blueberries at Tom Thumb because they're two for $3, but they were out of stock of the blueberries, but I did get a rain check. Um, so anytime, if there's a sale on something that you want, make sure to ask customer service for a rain check. You can go in you know, next week or whenever they restock get the same price. Anyway, if I didn't say it because I meant to say, I hope everyone had a fantastic new year and Merry Christmas and you're getting into your routine, getting things back together into the new year. I know um, it's hard <laughs> to get back into that routine um, and get, you know, life back going again. So anyways, let me show you all this craziness that happened at the stores today. What are you doing back there? <laughs> Let me show you. All right, so over here at Aldi again, $119. I got some mini bagels for quick um, little things for the kids' lunches or snacks or breakfast. Well, obviously breakfast. That's what I meant to say, not lunches. So breakfast, things like that. I have not had these tortillas before. They're 60 calories. They didn't have the ones I like. They do sometimes carry them. Um, so I, feel, I felt like 60 calories wasn't bad for the whole wheat tortilla. I've got some hummus here. It's just the classic you know, regular uh, hummus. The kids both like that. Some rice cakes, which I haven't bought rice cakes in a really long time. So I just got the lightly. She's talking about a donut that they got. And a caramel uh, corn rice cake. So I got both of those. And then cheese, we're out of cheese sticks. So I got the light string cheese and then just Colby Jack, um, cheese cubes. I went in for raspberries, like I said, because I think they were $1.69 or 79. My kids love raspberries and we don't often buy them because they're a little bit pricey. So we went in and got four of those. I did get some frozen blueberries. I like to put these in parfaits and oatmeal and things like that. Two ground beef. Now this is the only meat I got. I don't think you're going to see it in this haul, but I had a coupon to Imperfect Foods. It's online and they deliver food to your door. I had coupons sent to me for 50% off two orders. So I used that just to get meat and I ended up paying like 30 bucks or something crazy for a lot of chicken. They didn't have any ground beef though. So that's why I don't have any other like chicken. Two strawberry watermelon drink enhancers, three different types of salad. But what I'm gonna do is put this all together in one giant bowl and just like serve myself salad from the bowl, um, you know, for several, meals so i got one italian and then i got this asian chopped salad kit which these are a little bit pricier and that's another reason i like to mix because it lasts a little longer and then shredded iceberg lettuce that's just me being cheap for weird reasons i don't know um vinegar because i've been doing a lot of cleaning in the house like um the microwave the dishwasher and i'm running low on vinegar because i use that in to clean those so i got another one of those same with baking soda these are my favorite like fiber one bars, but they're the fiber now from Aldi. So it's just 90 calories. They're the cinnamon coffee cake one. Absolutely love those. My favorites to have with coffee. We were out of soy sauce. So I got the re re reduced, the reduced sodium soy sauce, two cans of black beans, two cans of um, green beans, one can of peas. Um, Ryan, uh, both my kids were with me because we're still on break. They go back to school or he goes back to school tomorrow. Nyla doesn't for another week. Um, but we're out of pickles and he asked if we could get some pickles. So I said, sure. Peanut butter crackers. I got a bag of avocado. I'm loving avocados right now, especially on salads and scrambled eggs. They did not have any of the English cucumbers that I love. So I went ahead and got mini cucumbers. One um, Alfredo sauce. This was the only can that are the only kind they had and they only had two left. Ryan asked if they could have some of these, you know, Nutrigain bar type things. So he picked a cherry. I got balsamic vinaigrette, which I really, really like. It's not the lowest in calorie. The My favorite as far as low cal 
is the um, Bolt House Farms yogurt dressing, the cilantro lime. That is, or cilantro avocado, I think is what it's called. That is hands down the best locale. Um, and I have some of it already, but I wanted this just to, you know, mix things up. I got some organic half and half for my coffee. I'm trying to cut back on these things because they're, they're filled with so much junk. But I mean, a lot of the stuff I eat, it has junk in it, but you know, cut back where you can. So I also got this delightfully pure coffee creamer and I liked it because the ingredients in it, it's non-fat milk, cream, sugar, and natural flavor. So it does have sugar, but at least we can pronounce all of those ingredients. You know what I mean? I was out of gallon storage bags and paper plates so i got those a bag of apples a bag of oranges um if you watch our lunch videos which they will be coming back also when the kids go back to school um we use these to make little sliders for the kids lunches so that's all i got for 119 dollars at aldi then this is what i got at tom thumb today their cheese was uh, on sale buy one get one free so i went ahead and got four i love parmesan cheese especially this shaved cheese uh, it is so good. So I got one of those, one fat-free mozzarella, one reduced sharp, reduced fat sharp cheddar, and one reduced fat cheddar jack cheese. This one solitary, look, I was going to get strawberries at Aldi, but they didn't have any. And this was $6 for this one little container of strawberries. That's like what, um, I don't buy huge bags of chips and like Doritos or Cheetos or anything like that. If I buy a huge bag of things, it might be pretzels or Pirate's Booty or Goldfish, something like that. These I don't often, not that these are a ton, you know, worse for you, but I feel like they are. So occasionally I will let the kids like get like a small bag. So they both got one Dorito and one Cheetos. Um, and then the DiGiorno pizzas were on sale for about $4. So I got one pepperoni and one cheese for like a quick lunch or supper. And yeah, so this all right here was $19. Oh, minus two donuts um, that the kids have already <laughs> devoured. Um, so that's everything here. And let me show you also what we got at Costco on yesterday. All right, you guys. So these are the couple of things that me and the kids picked up at Costco. I went in just for kids vitamins because they were on sale and the Annie's organic um, macaroni and cheese because they were on sale. So the Annie's macaroni, oh, and by the way, all this stuff cost $65, which is an absolute shame. So these ended up being just $12 and 50 cents after the, you know, 450 off. So I felt like that was a good deal. So I went ahead and got them. We don't eat macaroni like a lot, a lot, maybe once a week. So these will last us a long time. And I felt like for the Annie's brand, it was a good deal at like $12.50 for 12 of them. And I went in to get the kids some vitamins. I was really going to get two of these. But when I was like, I got all this, it was $65. I just got one of the Smarty Pans. They were originally $16.99 and they were $4 off this week. And then everything else was like spur of the moment. Um, so I got these once upon a farm. You guys, sorry, you guys, my kids are being so loud right now. So I got these once upon a farm, um, no sugar added fruit pouchy things. They're 12 in there. They are normally, they're usually $16.99. They were $4.50 off also. And then this I saw and I was like, I love this soap. It was these huge four for just $11.99. Soap, culture, hand soap, collection, moisturizing, hydrating. But I love the containers. Like those are so cool. So they have sweet orange, English pearl, uh, English pear. pear. <laughs> what am I saying? Pearl, pear. <laughs> English pear and then coconut vanilla and lavender thyme. So I just love those and I thought that it was a good deal for $11.99. So I picked those up uh, for myself and then the kids saw these and wanted them. So I went ahead and, you know, just let them grab them. They weren't on sale. I try to get these from Costco or Sam's when they go on a sale, but they weren't on sale um, at Costco. They're $14.50. So there's 20 bars in there. I'm sorry, 40. Anyway, I mean, that's way too much, way too much money. $65 for nothing. Like, <laughs> and my kids are being crazy, but anyway. Okay, so that's everything I got. I hope you like this video. I'm about to go dye my hair, y'all, because the silvers, they are not grays. They are silvers, are out of control. Even like sticking out from here. <laughs> like, 
silver everywhere. Um, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put all of these groceries away. So hopefully the next time you see me, I'll be a little bit less silver. Although I will have, will say that right before Christmas break, I filmed like two or three videos that I have not had an opportunity to edit yet. So my hair might be looking a little bit silver in those because they were before. Like I have a Hobby Lobby, um, haul and shop with me coming and actually a Tom Thumb haul and shop with me where I found all kinds of clearance stuff. That was last week though. So just keep that in mind if my hair is looking crazy like it is now. Um, so anyway, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Give us a big thumbs up if you did. So glad we could get back on here and hang out once again. And you can follow me on TikTok, Instagram. It's all linked down in the bottom girl. And I'll see you later. Bye. And P.S. Sorry, my kids were so like loud in this video. It's been like that a hot minute. I'm ready. <laughs>